What's going on Team Colossus? We've got a quick value video for you. You guys are gonna learn a ton from this, I guarantee it. We've been in fitness for eight years. We've been hitting the gym, staying consistent, being on our nutrition, being on that lifestyle, and we haven't slacked. And these are gonna be five tools that have allowed us to be able to do that. So if you guys know, number one for me is discipline. So it's all about being able to consistently do it. I mean, if you're only gonna go hard for three months, like here's a very common thing, especially with New Year's resolutioners. They come in super hard, they almost five times a week, I'm eating my meal plan, but the second they deviate from that, they go, screw it all, I'm gonna cheat, I'm gonna blow it all up, and they lose that discipline. So the key to discipline is also being a realist. So discipline plus realism is gonna equal success. So if you're brand new to something, or like let's say I'm new to jogging, I'm not gonna go, hey, I'm gonna run a half marathon today to warm up. That's not gonna work, I'm gonna burn out, I'm gonna injure myself, everything like that. So it's all about being intelligent and disciplined. So for me, I could start with my three-day push-pull legs, be disciplined with that in advance as I become more consistent. And discipline is what's gonna allow you to succeed in every measure of fitness, whether it's nutrition, fitness, lifestyle. And that brings me to number two, guys, is to kind of look at fitness from a broad view. So don't look at it just as personal training, or sorry, don't look at it just as workouts. So in the sense of personal training, what I was gonna say is if I have someone come in, I say, listen, I can work you out all day, I can work you out five times a week, there'll be some change, but we're gonna spin in circles if your nutritional lifestyle aren't in, uh, in check. So think of it like a stool. If a stool has three legs, right? three-legged stool. If I take one of those legs off, you can stay up, but it's gonna be hard to balance, and you're barely gonna be able to sit on that stool. Now, if I take away another leg, you're just gonna fall over, it's pointless. Fitness is very similar. Fitness, nutrition, lifestyle, I'm gonna say this again, to really repeat its significance, they kind of complement each other. So if you only have one in check, you're gonna spin in circles, so you have to be disciplined in all three. So obviously, fitness, in the gym, your routine, intelligent programming, sticking to your workout, stuff like that. Nutrition, you guys know the deal, not going crazy, not going overboard. Sure, it's fun to be hedonistic and eat a whole pizza, but that's really gonna deter you from your goals. So you gotta think this big picture kind of disciplined approach in all three views. And then the lifestyle is a big one that a lot of people don't think about. Are you going out on the weekend doing a ton of drugs, not sleeping or stressing yourself past your limit? Things like that. So you really have to look at all three. They're gonna complement each other and that's how you're gonna stay in the game and stay successful. Okay guys, tip number three, this is my absolute favorite, is always have something to work towards. You guys need to be setting goals with all of our online clients and all of our personal training clients. We always have weekly goals, we have monthly goals, and we have long-term goals. To stay in the game for this entire time and just like stay successful, I've always made sure to have something to work towards. We've done powerlifting meets for those of you guys who have been long-time subscribers. We've done a physique competition. Maybe we're trying to just cut, we're trying to bulk. There's always something. When you go into the gym, you're like, I'm gonna work towards this and I'm gonna get it done. So just have something to work towards and you guys will stay successful on your fitness journey. Number four guys, learn form properly. It stresses me out to talk about this because there are so many people that I just wish I could ingrain it into their minds, especially the beginners guys. You will stay long term, you'll see success. Going back to Josh's number one tip, like we have been in the game, we haven't spent much time out of the gym because we've taken time to learn form properly. You walk into the gym, you see a lot of guys with three plates, cat backing their deadlift, doing a lap pull down and just swinging way too much. Not only are you not gonna progress properly, but you're gonna injure yourself. You're not gonna see the results because you're gonna be out of the gym. So I want you guys to sit down right now, if you're new especially, watch all of our form videos, watch it twice, share with a friend, learn form properly, so that way you're never gonna hurt yourself and you're gonna see the results you want. Okay, number five, this is so simple, but I guarantee you, I know literally 100 people that do this. So we've all, I mean, if you've been going to the gym for a while and you go to the same gym, you're gonna know everyone in the gym, right? Like you're gonna be like, oh, I've seen this guy, I've seen this girl, this dude's crushing it. And then there's always those couple dudes that are there every day or every workout you're there and you're like, you literally live here and they look exactly the same or worse. So this sounds so obvious, but to some people it's not. You need to progress, you need to have some linear progression. So as you kind of become more advanced, you need to add more volume, you need to change your workouts, you need to change your specificities, make sure you're working on body symmetry, body composition, and that you're really just always looking to advance yourself and challenge yourself in new and unique ways. You can't just come and do the same thing and expect to progress, right? Lifting is all about progressive overload. So your body will adapt to what it's doing and it needs to be constantly challenged. Increase your strength, change your routines, have intelligent routines. And this is why we really recommend online coaching. Um, I think the number one reason people come to me and sign up, and this is the number one thing I can help with, and if this is you, let me know, let me know in the comments, is that they feel like they've been doing it, they've done okay, but they're just not able to get to that next level. You know, they're not able to kind of evolve and kind of 
transform into that next version of themselves, that super elite kind of, you know, going from that intermediate to that advanced class, that really strong, really on it, really jacked, you know, build those irons, build that physique. And the best way to do that is through online coaching, guys. You're gonna have someone who's gonna hold you accountable. I'm gonna do all your nutrition from you, I'm gonna have all your oversight, I'm gonna plan for you, I'm gonna do your goals, I'm gonna break things down. There's so much noise in the fitness industry, it's so annoying. And I sympathize for everyone because I know a lot of people want to progress, but they just can't. They're sucking that rut and they need someone to give them that push, give them that better programming. We do fully custom nutrition, fully custom training. Um, we give outside 24 seven support. So if that's something that interests you, fill out that form down below if you're a serious applicant. So what does that mean? A serious applicant is someone that understands that they're committed. We only take on people that we feel are actually gonna be able to advance and that are serious about what they're doing. So fill that out down below and let's see. Uh, if you like this video, we, we've been struggling to find things to film, but we're very passionate about talking about stuff like this. We've been in it for a while, and I mean, it's hard to be like, hey, work your bicep doing this curl when we've already filmed it. So if you guys like these talking kind of videos where it kind of gives you a little bit more perspective, uh, let us know, because we definitely want to film more. Smash that like button, subscribe, and we'll see you in the next upload.